I'm Thea Scott, um, I'm Marketing Manager at Big Gaming. Um, I've been there for two years now um, and when I arrived at Bead there was no marketing department, um, they were just building their commercial um, team so I've set that up um, and um, I run everything from our brand awareness to our internal marketing to communications to business development, um, anything that we could do to raise our profile um, and get more clients and um, employees interested in BEAD um, is in my remit. I think to start off with, when you come into a company that doesn't have a marketing department, it's quite difficult to um, get people to understand the full importance of it and how um, marketing runs across the whole business rather than just being a department. Um, uh, my MD has really embraced it now um, and he um, he's actually comes from a tech background but he loves the challenge so this is like his new thing so he loves it which is really useful it's really good if you can get someone who does actually get it um, and see the importance of it and um, I think also because people when you come into a company people want you to make an impact straight away um, but with marketing it's not just I'll do one thing and then everything changes overnight it takes a while, it's a lot of things working together over a number of different channels over a lot of time um, to really build up that like trust with your audience and respect with your audience. You want to sound genuine, um, which you know when you're trying to sell something is quite, <laughs> quite a challenge. I mean now the technology that's available it is just really helping to really understand your audience and their journey. Um, you know, customers now, and you'll know, right, we want a highly, highly personalized journey. Um, and that's what customers expect. And we do have the technology now to be able to um, track, measure, um, you know, the data that's available really to us. If you've got an e-commerce site, for instance, you can you know where your customers are coming from and you can tailor that experience depending on exactly what they're looking for. So I think now, you know, it's really more about um, like the data side of it and analysing that and really um, pushing brands to make sure that they're a personalised human, you know, journey that appeals to your audience. Um, it's been brilliant really, um, you know, like I say, I've been placed um, uh, like twice by you guys um, and I think, you know, there's a lot of agencies around um, and, you know, say they specialise in sort of sales and marketing roles, um, but from my experience I think NLG is really the only one that actually does specialise in sales and marketing roles. So I think just have confidence in your ability to get on and do things. Um, you know, I think the new generation coming through now are so good at just being like, I'm just going to try it. And I think that's, you know, so important. I think my generation maybe had too much respect for our elders um, and kind of we were there to like learn from them. We had nothing to offer. We were lucky to be in a job, you know, that kind of thing. Whereas like, I think, it, you know, if I could say to myself, just try something. Just see what happens, you know, really just trust in yourself and because I think that's what's happened over the course of my career is that now I've got more confidence in doing that obviously and now I'm like well, we'll just, let's just try it and see, um, you know, and um, like, you know, what's, like, what's the worst that's going to happen, we can sort it out and I think the new generation coming up have really got such a great attitude towards that and I think they've just got to have more of that, just, just try it.